Hi. It's been a while since uh, since my last shaving video. A um, couple of natural reasons for that. First, I have uh, I grew a beard last winter. So the project that I had in 2019, where I uh, documented every every single shave I did, uh, got its natural conclusion when I started growing my winter beard uh, during the fall, and uh, I kept that through most of the winter. And I've been sporting uh, quite, yeah, I've been shaving since the temperatures started going up a bit. We're now mid-July, it's late July actually, and uh, it's soon to be summer vacation on my part. So I thought I'd uh, spruce up a bit, try and at least look like a decent human being. I mean, uh, the, the current Corona situation in the world is making quite a few things quite weird. I don't have any better word for it. I mean, international politics is going down the drain, and uh, yeah, we see both the, the best and the worst out of people. Quite a bit of the worst, but um, I think that might be due to how media works. Not that it's inherently bad, but uh, I think they've gotten off course uh, when it comes to reporting facts and news. And they now just are like a pack of dogs trying to get the best piece of meat and quick. And that does not bode for quality work, I'm afraid. Hopefully that will improve, and um, we'll just have to be the best people we can. Make good choices and be be kind. Forgot that. Yeah, be kind. Uh, I'm using my trusty old. Uh, yeah, can't actually read it anymore, but uh, those who know recognize this one. Uh, Stemogu 1305, yeah, if my memory serves me right, which it really does. And uh, I'm using a tabac, a puck of soap. I actually used it. too little water in it. Laddered it up in a IKEA cup. And uh, for today's shave, I've chosen a trusty old. Uh, Gillette Slim Adjustable. Can't remember the date code now, but I think at least one of the Slims I've had in my possession is actually the, the James Bond variety. So that's great. That's nice. A few days uh, of growth now, so I'm uh, a bit curious as to how my face will react to this. The last time I did this, I had a, a blade that I've been using for a bit too long, so it tried to cut my face off. I've been healing ever since. So, slim adjustable, Astra SP. I think I've used that uh, a couple of times, but these blades are just... Magnificent. I think they're, well, at least good for four or five, three or four pass shapes. So it's um, my favorite blade, bar none. I'm just checking the blade gap because it's not entirely even. That might present a, not a problem, but a challenge. So let's see if we can't find a face under here. I tend to end up with most of the, the same equipment when I shave. 
I'm, uh, I'm doing this for yeah, nigh on seven, seven or eight years. The witch cheating thing, and uh, of course, I had periods where my racer acquisition disorder has made a mess out of things. I decided to scale down the collection at one point, so I had to inventory the collection, and uh, as a result, I ended up buying about 20 more racers. So, good luck, me. That's mostly the case most times when I try to scale down on hobbies. You'll have to try and figure out what do you have, what can you get rid of and actually get some money back from. And then suddenly you're there and you're finding things you've been looking for for years for a price you can dream of the last time you looked at it. Damn, took too much. I was planning on a gold tea, but... Uh, did a number on that. So, no cuts so far, at least. I've been having issues uh, getting the beard on my, my chin lately. So, not sure what it is, but I think that uh, I'm not uh, skillful enough with the angles. I end up just taking off the phone and leaving the bead. At least try not to put all that pressure on it. So let's see what we got. So not terrible for a first pass, but the chin really needs some work. So we'll ladder up again and do a across the grain, or well, I call it across the grain, but my beard grows every which way. So if I was supposed to take with the grain, I'd go all different kinds of ways. And I'm just not able to remember uh, which way to go on which face of my, where on my face I have to go down and up or something. So I just do one down, one across that way, one across that way, and one upwards. And hopefully that will take care of most of the stubble. I have to be pragmatic about it because I don't have the patience to do it properly. Let's see, you can do this one this time. get a very, very audible response from the racer when it, at least when it hits some stubble that it can work on.
So I need to be very careful around my Adam's apple. Um, I had a small surgery in my throat when I was just four or five years. So I have a, a bit of a scar that will bleed if I'm not careful. So, let's see. So, any of you guys ever, or during this last period, uh, ended up doing something that you haven't done before? Um, I mean, not necessarily when in regards to shaving, but other things. I mean, taking up old hobbies or found new hobbies, uh, tried learning some new skills or... I've had the good luck of having space in my basement for a small workshop. So I'm trying desperately to learn how to work with, with wood. So far I've mostly succeeded in spending all my money on tools, but um, I hear that is a hobby as well. So, go me. Really needed one more hobby. So now I have tool acquisition disorder. Okay. See? I believe I forgot to say which setting I did. Uh, let's see. And ah, yeah. Oh, setting nine. I actually should have dialed it down a bit after the first few passes. I'll do it before the last one though. And I normally put it down on setting number three. No. I feel that gives me the best results. Oh, okay. <laughs> Funny. I'm wondering whether any of you guys, if if other people doing 
vids like this are looking. Have you tried posting shave videos on TikTok? I'm finding that to be a very fun medium uh, with a lot of possibilities. But it also takes some skill in editing videos. And uh, my complete lack of uh, patience with technical stuff uh, leaves me in a pretty bad spot when it comes to that. But if anyone indeed does post shaving videos on TikTok, please leave me a, a comment uh, with, with a hashtag or something I can search for. I can find some inspiration. It would be fun to try and do one. Oh, I have a stubborn. You can see it right there. A few, and that, those are the blackest strands of hair in my face. And it didn't want to go away. So, I have to try again. Okay. A bit of extra attention around the nose because I have a B nose. And uh, here, I don't know where my nose here stops and my mustache begins, but it's a lot of hair. Okay. Yeah, it's not perfect, but it's a decent shave. So I have to be happy about that. Oh. Thanks for watching and uh, sorry about the bad filming. Have a nice day.